Hey, what's up everybody? This is Sama here. In this video, I'm going to show you how can you use the Domain Connect integration feature if you have a WordPress website hosted in your GoHelloSub account. So this is going to be really easy because previously, if you needed to add a domain or link a domain to your WordPress site, you will need to copy the DNS records, go back and forth. But now it's fairly easy because GoHello not only supports coded domains now with this feature, but also it supports IONOS or Cloudflare. So if you have a domain on any three of these, you will be able to seamlessly connect your domains to your WordPress site within seconds. So all you have to do is head over to your sub account and under site and WordPress, as you can see, I do have a WordPress site set up. So I'll just click on the three dots here, click on manage website. And then under info, if we scroll all the way down, we'll see that we are able to add a domain here. Now, this is of course a dummy or default domain. So if we need to add a custom one, we will click on add domain here. And now I'm gonna copy the domain that I have set up on Cloudflare DNS. So let's just copy this. I'm gonna come back here. And once you click on auto configure, it will take a few seconds and then you will see this pop up where it will try to find your domain details. So give it a few seconds and it will identify if this domain is on GoDaddy, IronOS, or Cloudflare. So as my domain is on Cloudflare, we'll see that it has picked that up. And now all we have to do is authorize domain. We do not have to add in any records manually. So you can also see here that which records will be added. So once you're happy with these settings, all you have to do is click on authorize domain. It will redirect you to the Cloudflare dashboard. And then you will see an option to authorize. So all you have to do is click on that. And once this is authorized, within a few seconds, this domain will be ready to go with your WordPress site. Once it is done, the pop-up will automatically close. And if we scroll down, you will see that the first DNS record is verified and the A record can take some time, but just try again in a few minutes and click on verified DNS records. If it is verified, it will connect your domain instantly. You can see that domain added successfully. So you can see how easy it was to set up a domain that was on Cloudflare. Again, this works with GoDaddy or IONOS as well. So if you have domains there, you can connect your domains to your WordPress site in a very easy way going forward. That was about this video. This is Sama signing off. I'll see you in the next one.